Hello. Welcome back to the channel. It looks like my doormat's here. And this seems awfully small for a doormat. But then, given the situation with the shower curtain stitch, honey, you're probably bigger than my doormat. You need to move, please. I was expecting a nice, heavy duty jute. Then again, I remember that one time I ordered a really nice, high-quality shower curtain and ended up getting a cheap imitation. So we shall see. Here's some bubbles. Want the bubbles? Stitch is a sucker for bubbles. And here's another box for you, sweetheart. Whoa, she got airborne on that one. I might be able to put this in front of my front door. It's not as thick as I thought it would be. Stitch, you can't see, honey. Please move. You weigh a ton. Oh. Yeah, I thought this was like a jute. I didn't read it. Like I said. But it's still gonna, it's still gonna, ouch. So, but I ordered. <laughs> so it's definitely not a trapdoor. So that is my doormat. And it's got this flower, floral pattern on the other side. So I'm going to put that, I guess, in my front, front of my front door, or inside, where I, when I walk in, so that I can hide that high traffic spot because, well, it finally decided to be winter and I can take off my shoes and put them on that. So again, it's not as, high, it's not as high quality. It's the same kind of issue I had with the shower curtain. It's not as good as the picture. So you definitely need to be careful when ordering from Amazon, like with anything else, uh, it's not always as good as it looks. I might end up ordering another one, maybe from another site, because like I said, this is not quite what I expected. It looks good, it'll do the job, and considering it's gonna get feet wiped on it, it's good enough, but the quality isn't what, it's it basically, yeah, I'm stumbling on my words. It's not the, as high a quality as I expected. It'll do the job. The detail is not as good as I thought it would be. I expected it to look more realistic on the graphics. So, yes, again, be careful. So I'm going to let you guys go. Um, we did the Band-Aids last night. I have a beer review that I did last night. I was going to upload today. So I'm going to do that. I... I did that after I did the unwrapping for the band-aids. So bandages, band-aid is technically a brand. So we went, we did the bandages yesterday. I'm going to upload the first one in the, no, second one in the retro hoppy pack. Um, it's Cream City, that'll go up tonight. And then this will go up tomorrow. And I've got a ghost pepper cheese curd um, that I want to review for you as well. So. Stay tuned for those. So he has the beer, then the trapdoor, and then some cheese. Probably, sp I wanted to space them out a little further, but it's I need to get I need to get back on a, an upload schedule to where I do a couple times a week. 
But with the holidays, I went ahead and was doing every day for a while. And now I'm going to run out. I might run out of uh, content. So I need to go back to a couple times a week. But when I get a package, I sometimes like to show it to you as soon as I get it. So it will, will duh, I'm stopping now. This is one big blooper reel. I will see you guys in the next video. If you like these videos, stumbly, bumbly, and blooper ridden or not, give them a thumbs up. If you want to subscribe, hit the bell once. If you want notifications, hit the bell a second time. Feel free to comment, but please keep it friendly. Share these if you want. Um, again, sorry, my nose is just, um, don't drag and drive with the other monsters drive the hearse. Let the DD designated Dracula drive if they want. And if they want to drink is what I was trying to say. Let them drink as well. Give them a turn. And stage move. Um, yes, don't forget your large umbrella and your 100 SPF so you don't turn into ash. And also, remember, I haven't said it lately, it's Halloween 365 if you want it to be. I love you guys. Bye now.